Recurring appointments are valuable for almost all industries. It's a great way to strengthen relationships with your regular clients and build a loyal clientele. When you give your customers the ability to book recurring appointments, you give them a sense of commitment. Stay with me and learn how to enable the recurring appointments feature and adjust it to serve your needs. Let's first activate the recurring appointments under Settings, Features and Integrations. An option to enable recurring appointments will appear on your service settings page. Toggle it on and you'll see additional options to set up recurring bookings. Here you can choose to repeat appointments daily, weekly or monthly. Limit number of recurring appointments option allows you to set the minimum and maximum number of appointments that your clients need to book to use this option. If you choose the first appointment only, your customers will only have to pay for the first appointment when booking their recurring appointments. Select all appointments if you want them to pay for all recurring appointments in advance. When your customer selects an unavailable time slot for some of their recurring appointments, Traft will recommend another date and time. Choose if you want it to be the closest date and time after or before the unavailable slot, or simply the closest one. Let me now show you how this option will be shown to your customers while booking. When the customer chooses the date and time for his appointment, a few options will appear. The customers can first choose if the appointments repeat daily, weekly or monthly. Next, they will set the appointment frequency and finally the number of appointments they want to book. This number will be within the limits you have set on the Edit Service page. If your customers are booking weekly recurrences, they'll be able to choose days in the week when the appointments are to be repeated. Lastly, if your customers are booking monthly recurrences, they can choose if they want the appointment to repeat on the same date every month, for example every 23rd in a month. The appointment can similarly be repeated every fourth Thursday in a month, or every first Monday in the month, and so on, depending on the day they choose for the first appointment. In case you set zero as your minimum limit on the Edit Service page, a fourth option will also be visible on your booking form. Your customers will be able to book this service and choose no recurrence here. Okay, so let's say I'm doing my hair every Saturday and I want to book appointments for two months in advance. That way I won't have to repeat the booking process every single week. I'll also be sure I have my appointment booked when it's most convenient for me. This is how I'll book them with Traft. Under the date and time step, I'll select Saturday, 12 p.m. This is my first appointment. Next, I'll choose weekly appointments and leave one here as I want my appointment to repeat every week and set Saturday here. I want to book my hairstyling appointment two months in advance, so I'll type 8 here, meaning my recurring appointments will end after 8 consecutive appointments. I click continue and can see the list of all the appointments. I double check dates and times, then click continue to finish up and book them. In case some of the slots for my recurring appointments are unavailable, I can delete or edit them here. As I already mentioned previously, Traft will recommend another date and time, according to the preferences you set under service settings. This is how easy it is to set your recurring appointments and keep your customers coming back. Please give this video a like and subscribe for more tips and tricks that will let you master Traft scheduling software. Thank you for watching.